Okay, so I just got my composite video to VGA converter. I've tried several of these unsuccessfully with my NES here. Uh, none of them could actually lock in on the colors and then recreate them out the VGA port. But then I saw a video uh, by Matt KC and I reached out to him and he recommended this guy. It was kind of uh, difficult to find because there really aren't any identifying sort of marks on it. No real sort of manufacturer. It's very generic. It's very plain, very basic. Well, basic it's not, it does a lot of stuff, but you know, here it is. All it says is, you know, video converter. Down here, there is no serial number. There's no model number, there's nothing. Um, but, you know, it worked. And so, what I wanna show you is my setup over here. And I've got my audio wired via these alligator clips for now until my adapter gets here. And then I have an inline volume control that I'm going to use to adjust the volume. And so over here, I'm going to turn on the NES over here. Okay, and then. I'm going to play Zelda. Okay. And it actually does look pretty good here in the recording. I had to play with the exposure a bit just to get it out here. So it could come out without the lines. And um, there might be... Yeah, it looks good, it looks good. And you can hear it. Yeah. The colors look pretty good, I'm impressed. I mean, for $15, this is a pretty good buy. I'm watching to control the volume with my inline volume control. And I'm going to move around just to show you, you know, how it plays. And it plays pretty good. I mean, there's no lag that I can detect. It feels, you know, like I am eight years old again, playing on an NES. I cannot detect the lag. It's really good, really responsive. It doesn't look, you know, like it did back in the day playing on a television set, but that's expected. You know, I'm on a VGA monitor and it's being scaled and you know all the little extra little magical things that happen with the electronics in here but um, I think it's a pretty good approximation it's very nice I, 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 I want to do this I recommend it the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to buy uh, maybe a Commodore 64, a VIC-20, a TRS-80 and then try it on this and see how you know how faithfully it's recreated but I expect it's going to be something similar. But yeah, so let me just kill myself here. And, um, you know, I'll put something up when I have something else. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this.